The Coast Guard was searching for Julian Lobeck, but someone else had been searching for him too, and had found him. Notice the natural design of this driftwood, worn smooth by the erosion of the sea. Thing of beauty, tremendous resilience. It has been conditioned by the very forces which shaped it. But you, my friend, have not been conditioned to treachery. In fact, you're quite the novice. So let's have none of it. Where's the other package? The what? There were two packages in the delivery. You brought me only one. Well, I brought what I found. Would you trade your life for a little plastic bag? But I haven't got it. I never did. My boy, that package has no value to you, but I assure you a great deal to me. Your life isn't worth a fig until I get it. I haven't got it, believe me! I'd give it to you if I could, believe me! Maybe I lost it when George and I... I'm waiting. The rest of it. George found out I was working for you. He told me to quit. And when I told him I wouldn't, he followed me to the cave and he tried to take the package from me. We got into a fight and when I when I saw what happened. I headed back to the swan. And when I, when I climbed aboard, I realized I was holding the package. Two packages. One package, you gotta believe me. I do. I want you to go back and get the other package. Find it. But the Coast Guard's all over that area. You'll pick it up this afternoon. We're expecting another delivery at the caves. You can kill two birds with one stone. Oh, no. My boy, you have no choice. You will do as you are told. But the Coast Guard... You have no choice. This afternoon at four. He'll never hold up. I know. It will be your mission to cast the first stone. And be sure the right bird is the target. Yes, sir. <laughs>